Hey guys, what is going on today? It's Jake, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about ExoZombies Carrier and the new weapons implemented into this map. There's three new weapons that were included in this map. Now, we have seen them previously, but that was from multiplayer, but they've been br brought into ExoZombies. So, the first one being the Ohm, which is a shotgun light machine gun variant, as well as the new uh, Limbo Wonder Weapon, and as well as the M1 Irons. I'm going to be talking about which one's like the best and which one's fun to use and which one's just all around better and just see if you guys want to use these guns when you get this in the uh, 3D printer. So I hope you guys enjoy. If you do, make sure you guys leave a like on today's video. It really helps me out. And also subscribe for more Call of Duty Zombies content. So the first one that I'm going to be talking about is the M1 Irons. Now this is dual wield straight out of the 3D printer and you get six rounds in each cylinder and then you get, uh, I, it's a lot in reserve ammo, it's pretty uh, high, high uh, mount. So anyways, once you get this gun, it's pretty beast. Uh, you need to upgrade it a couple times for it to be very effective in the later rounds, but right when you get it, if you get it on the early rounds, it just mows through the zombies. Now the only problem with this weapon is the ammo. It runs out very fast. And although you could just upgrade to get more ammo, and when you upgrade, I think past Mark IV, you get more in the cylinder, you get 9 instead of 6, it still runs out very fast. You will not be able to survive a whole round without having to upgrade your weapon. And you only get 20 upgrades, so that's going to go uh, run out pretty fast. But in my opinion, this is very fun to use, these guns and zombies. I was really excited that they brought it into this game because it's just really fun to use, especially when you double tap Y and it does the little spins. It's really awesome. And I love this weapon, but it's probably the least uh, effective out of these three weapons that I'm talking about. So this is just a number three spot for the best weapons that they've included in the new map carrier. The next weapon I'm going to be talking about is the Ohm. Now I'm very excited they brought this into the game too as well, especially because they allowed the shotgun variant as well. And I believe that the shotgun variant tops the LMG variant of this weapon. It is just complete beast mode. Even at round 30, it takes like three or four shots to kill one zombie, which is actually very effective considering exo zombies is very difficult when you get into the higher rounds. And as well as the light machine gun mode, if you want a lot of points, just switch over to that. Just get a round of zombies and just get mow them down. It doesn't kill them very fast, but you do get a lot of points. Now, of course, they needed to balance this weapon, so using the light machine gun also uses the shotgun uh, variant ammo as well and using the shotgun vice versa so if you're using the shotgun variant it's kind of it's like half the ammo of light machine gun and it's just it, it goes a lot quicker but it's a lot more effective I believe this is one of the best guns to have if you want to go for a high round or just survive as long as you can it's very good with the shotgun mode especially if you're running through the tight quarters you could kill zombies very quick going down now the last weapon we're talking about is the new wonder weapon, the LZ-52 Limbo. This thing shoots out a laser vertically and kills any zombie in its path and it's a very awesome wonder weapon. The only problem I have with exo-zombie wonder weapons is they're too underpowered. And I understand that because from the traditional Treyarch zombies, each wonder weapon could just wipe out a whole horde as in exo-zombies is on a basis of the more challenging side. So I understand that, but it is one of the best wonder weapons we've gotten in Exo Zombies. This is actually very fun to use, and I've figured out that if you just aim towards the head, it actually counts for headshots, and it kills them a lot faster. All in all, this map is probably the greatest Exo Zombies map to date. It's they've implemented new perk, a new perk, new drops. Uh, new traps, they've just listened to the community and they've succeeded and I really enjoy this map and it's probably one of the best maps uh, uh, in Exo Zombies. I'm not covering the new special grenades because it's pretty self-explanatory is teleporting grenades as well as there's something new in the box for um, a special grenade as well but I've never gotten it and I don't even know what it does and it's not very relevant to me but anyways I hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe to the channel I'll talk to you guys next time goodbye